So let's look at elementary transformation of matrix to start with. The idea of elementary operations finds relevance when we are operating on the coefficient matrix representing the coefficients of a linear equation. The idea is that if I apply these elementary operations on this matrix, then after the application also, the solution to the equation does not change. Whatever is the solution used to get with the original matrix, you will get the same solution with the operated matrix also. So let's look at the various row operations. Number one is interchanging of rows. That is, if you interchange the rows of the original matrix and get a new matrix, there won't be any change in the solution. Operation number two is multiplying any of the rows with a constant non-zero number. And operation number three is adding the multiple of a row to another row. After doing all these things, the new matrix is called as the row equivalent of the original matrix. Similar to row operations, you can also do column operations. The same principles, the same rules which we spoke about will be applicable, albeit with a column instead of row. While finding a solution of linear equation using this method, one thing you have to keep in mind is whatever row operation or column operation you apply on the coefficient matrix, the same has to be done on the constant matrix also. Then only P consistency be maintained and the solution be the same. To keep learning with such engaging videos, download Byju's, the learning app today.